maybe they'll be there to help you. They'll have to figure out how they're going to help you. That's Bryson and Elijah and uh, Emilio. The three of you need to discuss how we're going to... Uh, they're required to do it fast. They, they've got deadlines each and every time. Um, it's, it's really neat to watch how much quicker they are moving, uh, how much harder it is to get an interview in because they're like, hey, we got, we got work to do and things, things to get done. Yeah, I want to have a meeting right here. I want to know how things are going to work. Yesterday we uh, installed the insulation on the bottom box uh, put together with these glue lamps. Uh, after that we cut and uh, glued and nailed down our uh, flooring, our subfloor, and then uh, Today we're going to be installing the by wall and the butt wall glue lambs and that will uh, put the roof on this thing and then we're going to get started into framing. Uh, a lot of these guys, this is their second build and uh, they're just moving way faster than I anticipated. Like uh, the, to get where we are now on the first build, not including OSHA classes and all that, uh, I think that was like took us two weeks maybe and this is day three now so we're moving pretty quickly they're working pretty fast and um, it's exactly where we thought they would be and uh, excited to see the rest of the framing come today we got inspections today so they're gonna have to work hard and fast to get this finished these uh, clam clips need to come out and then they'll be installed on the by wall glue lamps <laughs> I gotta change the depth of my saw. And that should be good. One of the problems we have as employers is people who aren't working. They stand around on the job, they watch other people work, they don't do those kinds of things. One of the most important things that we teach at Ideal is to take charge, to get things done. When they need to get done, you do them immediately. Then when another thing comes up, you do it immediately after that. It's a, it's a very hard skill to teach, and yet we figured out a way to teach it. Uh, so I am making the cuts so that this will fit in like that and after we get it ready to hang on the other glue lamp. So. Flush. But we learned yesterday that uh, these clips need to be connected to the glue lamb that's going to be going here, not connected to this. So when we lower this into place, we need to make a little notch right here. It's super important to not only Tucson and Southern Arizona, but to the entire state and the entire nation, being able to get out good quality people good quality craftsmen that know how to initiate work and how to finish that work and um, it's a testament to what it is that we're doing here. So when we have these installed on the by wall, these are going to be able to slide into place like that and then be able to, or this will be able to slide into this I should say, like that. So this one is pretty much good to go and ready. So take a saw and just cut off this little chunk right here on both sides. So sometimes they come with a factory cut on them where this side is totally squared up. This one is not. So we have to make, cut this side, flip it around and then cut the other side. I just squared up this end here and drew a line here. And that's where my cut will be, right there. And I'll take this off and square this piece perfectly 90 degrees. Well, perfectly 90 degrees. And uh, then we'll measure 21 feet from here to there and cut off that side as well. But I'm gonna wait until this is cut off before I make those measurements. Now we're waiting on uh, Austin to get his cuts. Yeah, hurry up you. Yeah, give me just a little bit. Perfect, good. So 
So this thing here is a template that was built so that um, it could just fit over the piece of lumber and then this hole right here. Yeah, I was just checking. I come, Billy, on my bad. That's cool. Maybe that's how we're supposed to do it. Hey, Nelson. Uh, yeah, the, the goal that I want to get accomplished is have all four of the beams up and in place and the eye joists going across installed and then hopefully we'll be already started on framing the walls. Get it tight, get it right, and don't get hurt, I guess. <laughs>